but what's up guys i know i know a long time no see in today's video we're going to be talking about my favorites of march and a little bit about what's been going on with me and why i've been missing so <laughs> i feel like i come on here and explain that often but um yeah let's go ahead and jump into today's video if you like videos like this please give today's video a thumbs up and if you aren't already subscribed please subscribe to the channel okay so before we get into my favorites let's just talk about where i've been and what's been going on so as you guys know i am a brand owner so that takes up a lot of my time i'm still trying to learn how to balance doing youtube social media and running my business my brand is doing pretty well i've been featured in essence recently cosmo and l like that is super exciting i know i promised you guys videos about business and running my business but honestly guys i've been learning as i go this is my first time being a business owner so it's definitely a learning process but um if you guys have any videos you guys would like to see based on being a business owner and things about my business let me know down below i would be happy to do that for you guys i recently released my spring collection of accessories so that's just been taking up all of my time like i wear all the hats i'm the creative director i'm the one who makes all the business promo stuff i pack the packages i'm the one running the website so it's a lot and on top of that it's not that i haven't been recording it's just that i haven't liked the footage that i did record so i did do a video for the sephora sale but I started to notice that a lot of the products that I would have recommended to you guys I recommended in the last video so that's to tell you that I haven't really been trying out a lot of makeup that I've been loving like absolutely loving yeah with all that being said let's go ahead and get into the video um I felt like we needed to catch up so something that would have been on my recommendations list is the NARS light reflecting foundation I'm obsessed with this foundation I have not put it down since I got it and I got it in the shade Caracas. it's such a beautiful foundation I do have a review if you guys would like to check it out but it's amazing so far I've tried two of NARS newest um foundation formulas and i understand the hype I understand why you girlies go absolutely insane for NARS and this new one does not disappoint it's so good um it's not like a full coverage foundation it's more medium to light depending on how much you apply but it just looks so beautiful on the skin if you're a lover for dewy skin this foundation is the way to go okay so another thing that i've been loving is the the patrick top blushes and i feel like that was on my recommendation list from the last sephora sale but yeah I love the cream and powder blush combo. This one right here is Oh She's Different and I also have the three of the newest shades that he released. But I have it in this limited edition packaging. Now you have to buy them individually but this came out during the holiday season and I was able to get all three of them and I love every single last shade. Another one of my favorites which I'm kind of surprised by is these lashes by Ardell. These are the Naked Lashes in style 421. And I have them on right now. They're just so beautiful. And to me, they look pretty natural. <laughs> I still love a good make lash. You guys know I love my lashes from Caprio NYC, which is owned by a fellow YouTuber. She has a lash brand and she has so many beautiful lash styles. But outside of my love for mink lashes, I really do enjoy these naked lashes from Ardell. I buy them from Amazon, four in a pack for $12, and I'm obsessed. I saw a recommendation for them on Instagram. According to them, these are the lashes that they use on Euphoria for the character Cassie. These are the lashes that she was wearing on the show, and even if she wasn't specifically wearing these lashes, I'm still obsessed with them. They're so beautiful. I've been totally obsessed with the Milani um, Fruit Fetish Lip Glosses. I have all the colors, but the other one is in my bag. These are so nice. Um, they're like really nice and light on the lips and they just add like a tint of color. All of them except for this one because it's yellow. Um, I'm not sure how it looks on lighter skin, but when I put it on, I can't see it. And then the other three, the other one is also like a, a reddish pink color. It just adds like a light hint of pink to your lips but they're so nice and they're also scented some people say that they're a dupe for the dior lip oil but 
to me the formulas are different i kind of enjoyed the milani one a lot more but yeah it's basically preference they both glow really beautiful on the lips i think that might be it when it comes to like makeup because i haven't really been wearing a lot of makeup or trying out makeup this month so i think that's it now we're just gonna go into miscellaneous things um one of my favorites for marsh is my dyson air wrap <laughs> oh gosh so i was lucky enough to get my hands on one of these i don't know how but they sell out every time that they restock them and i had on my alerts for this for on sephora so i was able to get one so i've been pretty much using it all month on my hair and I do love it for the first half of march i still had like my sewing i still had a sewing in so i was using it on my sewing and then when i took my hair out and i washed it i've been using it on my natural hair as well i'm, I'm gonna show you guys clips of both i'm still getting the hang of it of like what works best for my natural hair i'm still trying out some things i did record a video for you guys using it on my natural hair but i hated it so you guys let me know if you guys want me to record that video i also have the regular blow dryer which is tens across the board i absolutely love that one so yeah um let's see another one of my favorites is this hair claw from my brand seven mia this is called the drew claw this is the first product that i actually named after myself because that's how much i love them i also have it in green um it's such a beautiful hair claw and, and it works for just about any hair type whether you're sh you have straight hair or you have kinky curly hair it will secure your hair and hold it up and i just love how shiny and pretty it is i'm just obsessed with it right now y2k fashion is like super on trend and hair claws are like totally in right now so so i absolutely love wearing this hair claw um if you love hair claws i have a lot of them on my site right now all different kinds sizes and shapes if you guys would like to check that out i'll link my website down below and i also have a coupon code for you guys if you like to check it out another one of my favorites that i've been completely obsessed with is is oddly enough some jeans earlier this year i decided to go and try out some jeans jeans is one of those things that's kind of hard for me to like pick out online and that's what i was pretty much doing by shopping on fashion nova i don't know i don't hate the jeans that i got from fashion nova but i also think that they weren't the best quality of jeans yes i do think the jeans fit better on women who have curves but the quality just wasn't there for me and they weren't as comfortable so i went to Saks. i tried out a whole bunch of different brands and jean types and i've been totally obsessed with hudson jeans hudson is not cheap but the, the quality makes it worth it like there's a specific pair of jeans that i am super in love with i wear them all the time and that's weird for me jeans is one of those things i don't necessarily want to wear but these jeans they just go with everything and they're so comfortable so i got two jeans from hudson that's pretty much the same wash but they're different styles i'll leave pictures up for you guys because the jeans are not presentable for me to show you guys right now they're actually in the wash but yeah i bought some from hudson and i bought some from a brand called redone like a pair of shorts those jeans are so nice um i find that with hudson jeans for me they don't leave that little gap in the back like if you have curves you know what i'm talking about so like they fit me perfectly if you guys would like to see a jean like a jean try on haul let me know because denim is like one of my favorite things right now and if you guys would like to see that let me know and that's about it i'm currently trying out a lot of different products so i'm hoping by the end of april i'll have some new stuff to share with you guys but that wraps up today's video if you like videos like this please give it a thumbs up and if you aren't already subscribed please subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye.